It's been a while. It's been a while. God bless you all, and I pray peace is upon y'all families today. This is Andre Way. We just released, and uh, I just come to just uh, speak on a little some things and uh, head on out watching this football. Them Texans won yesterday. Need to pull these Cowboys through today. Yeah. Uh, it's been a while, man. It's been a while. What I mean by <coughs> it's been a while. It's, it's been a while since, you know, I, I truly, you know, feel the way I feel towards us being free. I, uh, you know, it, it, at times, I, I just feel that, I feel that freedom. I feel that freedom and, and, I, and, and I feel the blessing that the, the freedom brings. I was reading a comment a while ago, and 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 and, and, it, was, and it was saying something about you know it, it it it's hard to get people to feel sorry for you. Well, you know I don't do this show for people to be, feel sorry for me. I was I was once asked, why don't you uh, tell them stories on YouTube, Dre? Right? So, and then, you know, this is how it all started. This is how it all started. Because I've been a storyteller most of my life. And and, and, and telling stories, uh, a, a guy told me one time, he said, man, you always telling a story. See, if, if you ain't got no t story to tell, that means you ain't did no living. Because when we have stories to tell, either as incarceration stories or, or, you know, of any kind, you should want to tell somebody the stories. You should want to talk about them. They're stories. You know, we read books about stories. We read books about adventure. So you have people that write books about their stories. Matter of fact, I wrote two books. One called Cable Runners. And this book was given to me in a dream by God. And I wrote it, and I wrote it uh, like a comic book. And it's called Super Mutt. Man, that's an awesome book. This is an awesome book. I'm trying to figure out a way how I can get these books published and get them proofreaded. If y'all know anybody, I'd like to contact me and let me know uh, who I can contact about these books because these are some awesome books. I'm telling you, these are some awesome books. But, man, I'm, 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 I'm happy. I'm happy. Even though I'm broke, but I'm still happy. I'm thankful, even though I'm broke. But I'm thankful. And I ain't looking for nobody to feel sorry for me, but I, I, I did look f for help out of my viewers. And, 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 this, and this help here, you know, it, it only consists of telling people to push the like button. When they watch my show, y'all tell these people to push that like button. Push that like button. You know, we're trying to, you know, get this to a point where, uh, It can be, it can grow, and I had some, I had some phone calls, man. I had some phone calls. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'm, I'm scheduled to do an interview with a guy out of, out of California today. I suppose I've done it yesterday, but I got caught up and did wasn't able to do it. So I'm, I'm supposed to uh, uh, get with him today. Hopefully, uh, the interview will take place, and if we do, you know, uh, he's looking for some help on having some contacts out here in Texas because a lot of the interviews that he have are basically in, in California and they, they mostly interviews that he have with men in, inside the institution. So, you know, uh, you can contact me on that because this guy, you know, he do interviews and and, and he and if your people is in a, in a manner of needing help or, or needing to speak out, then he probably can... Uh, 
get with them, you know, that's still incarcerated. So, and, and, and once you contact me about that and you would like to have that done, then I can contact him and let him know. You know, or you can send, uh, send uh, your loved one information. And, and this is not just for me in prison. This is also for the women in prison also. So uh, this, this goes both ways, you know. It don't just go one way. You know, this ain't about just men. This is about the women too, you know. And I told you, uh, uh, if you want to speak out on my show, you know, just uh, contact me and, and let me know. And uh, we'll, we'll set up something to, to get an interview with you guys. Because I know, you know, it's a, uh, a lot of people out there that, that love their loved ones that's incarcerated and they want to, uh, you want to see them free. You want to see them free. And I told you a while back that just release ain't just so much about being released from prison. You know, it's just, it's being released from anything that's been hindering you in your life. So, you know, if, you, if, if something's been hindering you and been having you, you know, up and down, up and down, you know, you can you can contact me and we can talk about it. We can pray over it. And also we can uh, see about placing that person uh, on, on, on the on on the interview because you know uh being able to be free from something and this is good and, 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 and when you're free from something people would like to know what you did to <coughs> overcome that you know and, and this is why we speak out you know also i, I don't know if i uh, spoke of it but uh last week i was uh contacted by the Project Innocent people, you know, who've been working on my case since 2015, because to, I told you two counts of those aggravated robbers I didn't do. Well, they are they at the point where they 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 them start stopping their uh, in, uh, investigation and about to uh, try to put it, bring it back in court. Ah, uh -huh, yeah, they about to bring it back in court. And Lord, you know, if I win that case. Cause you know I gave it to God a long time ago. I gave that case to God a long time ago. You know, even though we be innocent of some things and be still found guilty of it, because they they find us guilty of our past sins here in the state of Texas. You know, they 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 look at the the things that you done, not what you did, but the things that you done. And, and they and they convict us on it, you know, and, and that's not right. That's not right. So many people, man, that, that, that been to prison and, and still in prison behind uh, cases they've been charged with that they didn't do. That's not right. You know, they're supposed to be uh, proven guilty. And they don't have to prove you. They just find you guilty. They don't have to prove you guilty. They just find you guilty, you know. Uh, that's a prejudice uh, courtroom that we go in front of, and, uh, and, and, and they buy us in so many ways when they come to, that, to this law. And, and like I say, they only see it, the law in their way and not nobody else's. They, they disrespect their own law. They don't care. But they just try to get a conviction on you, you know. But uh, if you're traveling, I pray that uh, safety is upon you and uh if you're going, you know, to Styles, or if you're going to uh, the guest that, you know, you uh, tell your loved ones that uh, Andre Wade said hello to his brother, Timothy Wade, on Styles and his nephew on uh, guest unit, Daniel Williams, you know. Uh, let them know that I love them, and uh, I tell somebody about that just release up in there. And, and spread the word, because we are uh, we speaking out, we're growing. And you know, cause this 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 is like a family, man. This is like a family. You know, I hear so much about this YouTube stuff, man. And and you know, to be honest with you, you know, uh, it's 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 great, man. It's great, man. But it's it's wonderful, and uh, I'm thankful. Christmas coming up, and I just pray that your gifts be well appreciated. And be thankful. This is Andre Way with Just Release. And I'll be back. Ah!